A good leader communicates openly. Hello and greetings, my dear followers and subscribers. This is Coach Sue coming at you with tea. So we're still in the month of October and we're still talking about what makes a good leader. So we're on day 10. And so the next characteristic I want to talk about um, that makes a good leader is um, that they communicate openly. A good leader communicates openly. What do I mean when I say that? I mean that when uh, things are going on with the department or with the company, they are communicating with their team to keep them informed. They're not trying to hide anything unless they're told not to share it. But um, if they get information from their boss, they're going to they're gonna be responsible enough to come and let their team know. Uh, they don't want their team to be surprised or shocked when they get good news, especially if changes are taking place that affect them personally. So a good leader makes sure that they communicate that. Oh my goodness, I gotta tell y'all this. So, when you're about to be promoted and you get the offer or the call and your leader did not inform you, yeah, you'd be happy, but then you'd be like, well, dang, you need to let me know. A good leader will let you know, hey, something's coming down the pipe, just be ready for it. It's going to be a great thing. You're going to be very happy, so that way they're not thrown off. But I'm more that I don't like surprises. I don't take surprises very well. Others are just probably the same way. So, if you're a good leader, make sure you keep your team informed. Communicate openly with them. Don't hold back anything unless you're told not to share it. And if you're not one that shares, start sharing. That way they build that trust with you. That's all I got for today.